To recreate this superhero landing scene from Thor, we will shoot two videos. I shot the outside video in reverse to make it more steady. Drag and drop this video into the timeline. Then from the speed control, we will reverse the clip. So we got the background. Then drag and drop the other video. We need to remove the background from this video using AI tools. Smart cutout will be used because in AI portrait, the detection might not be perfect because of the hammer. So in smart cutout, select the area you want to cut. Make sure the selection is done perfectly. You can zoom in and delete some parts using the eraser tool and also add to the selection using the brush tool. Add some edge thickness and edge feather. Then click here to start the smart cutout process. So this is how it looks now. Next, we will be using keyframes to make the person smaller to bigger because uh, he's flying from sky to the ground. So uh, we will scale down the person and also move him up, add a keyframe, then move the playhead to the point when the person is on the ground. So make him human size and add another keyframe. This is how it will look. Do the size and position adjustments according to your video. Next, it's time to add the effects and stickers. We will use mostly lightning VFX because it's Thor, the god of thunder. So go to the stickers and search for superhero lightning VFX element 05. Now we will place this sticker effect behind the person so that it doesn't cover him. Next, the sticker needs to be resized and matched with the person. So we will be using keyframes. Let's place it behind him here. Then move the playhead, reposition and resize the sticker following the person. Add keyframes accordingly. So this is how it looks now. You can lower the opacity if you wish. Before we add more stickers and effects, let's add the sound effects. We first used this whoosh sound. Place it in the appropriate place. We are also adding a thunder sound effect. Another sound effect I used is called frozen whoosh transition SFX. Now it's time for stickers again. This is superhero landing VFX element 06. It should start when the hammer touches the ground. It should also not overlap the person. So let's switch the layers. Let's search for another sticker called electricity 10. We can add two layers of this same sticker, rotate it, flip it and place it around the superhero. Another lightning sticker is there, electricity energy one. We will use multiple layers of this sticker around this superhero landing place. There is another very interesting lightning effect called superhero lightning vfx 15 we will place it where exactly the hammer smashes the ground and it should not cover the hammer or the person so let's place it behind the person lastly we will go to the effects tab and search for an effect called extreme that will basically shake the footage so place it when the hammer touches the ground if the superhero lightning effect is covering too much of the background, you can remove it after this point. So let's do it and see how it looks. So this is how I recreated this superhero landing scene. You can do it yourself in your Wondershare Filmora 13 editor. Try it yourself. Check the description for more awesome videos like this.